Hello there. I am Meredith Yanishanis, and I just want to thank you so much for being here and joining this webinar to learn more about the Fiat Focus program. If you are here or you're watching the recording, that tells me something about you. It tells me that you are a woman who is very dedicated to her faith, that you are somebody who wants personal growth in your life, and that you're someone who's seeking a goal and knows enough about yourself that accountability would be, would be beneficial for you. But what I want to share today goes beyond accountability. Before we get into that, though, I just want to open in prayer. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. Come, Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of your faithful and enkindle in them the fire of your love. Send forth your spirit, and they shall be created, and you shall renew the face of the earth. Amen. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. So what exactly is Fiat Focus? If you have been around my Instagram page for a little while, you know this is brand new. I just started having the idea of doing rosary workouts in about September of 2022, and then I launched the first group with four rosary workouts on October 1st, the Feast of St. Therese, my patron saint, and it ended on the Feast of Our Lady of the Rosary. And it was so amazing just to hear the feedback from these women, to get a taste of what that was like for people to work out while praying and to get more out of prayer, to see things from a different lens while they were doing the workout, physically moving while having their mind meditating on Jesus and Mary and these mysteries of our faith. It was just so rewarding for me. And I wanted to do more, to give more to people, to be able to reach more people as well. So on October 16th, we started a 54 day rosary novena. And part of my prayer intention was just see what the Lord has in store for me. And that just ended on the Feast of the Immaculate Conception. And throughout that time, God has blessed this in so many ways. I just hosted my first ever Advent retreat where I got to share a rosary workout in person with a whole bunch of women. There were 35 women who came and worked out in this gym of all ages and walks of life. It was such a blessing to get to lead that. I created this website. I've added a total of 22 more rosary workouts. So if you've gotten a taste of that, then you know what this is about. If you haven't yet, I invite you to try because it's a really unique experience and it challenges you physically and mentally and spiritually to just dig deeper into your soul while you're strengthening your body and your soul and your spirit, drawing closer to the Lord in that exercise. So the Fiat Focus is another step beyond the workouts that are associated with Fiat Fitness. In the workouts, you're really focusing on prayer, and exercise in that moment. And in Fiat Focus, we're going beyond that. So this is for some women who want more out of their life. They want more peace, they want more energy, more health, more joy, and more order in their lives. It's for women who want a better relationship with themselves and with the Lord and with those around them too. So I don't want to make this too long. I want to dive right into this. The three aspects of what Fiat Focus are primarily First of all, is you have the rosary workouts. You're going to get access to all of the rosary workouts that are on the Fiat Fitness uh, membership portal for the entire year. So if you start with me in January of 2023, that entire year, you're going to have access to the workouts. That's going to include the 26 that are already there, plus four every month that I'm going to be adding, at least four every month. So 48 new workouts. I mean, so you get 74 workouts that are included, and I have some bonus um, divine mercy chaplet workouts and litany of the blessed virgin mary that are already there as well you're also going to get to be a part of that fiat fitness community it's like a family i want to call it my fiat fitness fit fam it's kind of a mouthful but um we have weekly calls monday nights at 8 30 we just discuss either a bible study or a devotional really get to know one another and have time to pray for one another and it's been so powerful to see these women connecting with one another from all across the country, even Canada, Japan, we have women from around the world and this is just getting started. So to have that kind of connection where we can share prayer requests, we can be praying for one another throughout the week and then having a group on Facebook right now where we can connect and just strengthen one another, support one another, cheer one another on, that provides such that, that need for community that we as women especially have. So you get that access for the entire year. Secondly, you get this peaceful and productive planner that I have made. And I'm gonna give you a peek at it real quick. I originally came up with an eight week planner, but this has just been revised to be 12 weeks. So there's a first page with has your schedule. 
um, the top 10 things you need to do in a day, where you can track your food and water, some things you're grateful for. And on the other side, this is really more of what we're going to get into with coaching, where you have your thoughts, your prayer reflections. What are some of the personal things that you want to track? And maybe you have no idea where to start, but this is where taking the time to really think about our thoughts. And that might be something that you haven't done very much lately. I'm going to kind of talk a little bit more about that as we get into this. Um, but diving more deeply into your thoughts and allowing yourself to grow in these areas where you maybe have been kind of rigid and like, this is my view. This is what's fact. This, this will never change about me. This is who I am. I'll never be able to go to that goal. Does that sound like something that's from the Lord? God sees you as a unique, incredible, beautiful woman that he wants to help. He has gifts for you. He's already given you talents and gifts. He wants to see you use them. So in the coaching, you're going to get more help to decipher what those things are and how you can best use those and how to manage your mind around those. But the other item that comes with the planner, because this is going to be so instrumental in helping you throughout the 12 weeks of the coaching program, you also get um, an ebook that has recipes, meal plans, things to help you with the nutrition aspect of this, because my background primarily is health and fitness. But as a convert, coming into the church was the number one decision that I've made in my life. Just getting to understand the fullness of truth in the Catholic church. And it's been what I've based all of my decisions in my life off of <laughs> from that point forward. So I want to be able to help you with the experience that I've had of really studying my way into the church, seeing um, life as an athlete, transitioning into a mother, managing my time, having a business, homeschooling, all these aspects you know, life is not just one category. I can't just say I only can help you in health and fitness because maybe there's something that connects with you in a totally different um, atmosphere or arena. And that's something that I want to help as we go into coaching, draw out, see where you specifically feel like you need help and to draw, you know, pull the Lord into this. He says in the scriptures, where two are gathered in my name, two or more are gathered in my name, there I am also. Sometimes it's hard to just think about our own problems or our own wants and needs without having somebody to discuss it with and without having um, somebody who's more objective, their point of view to help really see, like pull the lens back a little bit, see what's going on and what's going on in our own minds can even be so challenging to figure out. So what has benefited me the most about coaching? I got my own business coach about a year ago. And up until that point, I had been so resistant about it. I was like, I know what I need to do. I just need to do it. These are the things like I got to check the boxes off. Why can't I do this? Why am I not seeing more growth? Why are things not changing for me? And I, I think about that mindset in terms of before I had um, a personal coach versus you know, as a gymnast, I spent from the age of three to 22 as a gymnast, I would never have walked into the gym and expected to learn a new skill if I didn't have a coach. And in gymnastics, you need somebody telling you exactly what to do, the progressions that you need to do it and the drills that you need to do to get to that point. Somebody to spot you, somebody to help you. If you're going to crash, they catch you when you're falling and to give you the proper feedback so that you know how to make the changes to finally get that skill and then to master it. Because once you learn it, it's not like you're ready to compete right? It's the same thing in life. If we're struggling in an area, we might need somebody to help us to identify that. We might not even realize we're struggling, you know, until we have somebody pointing it out to us or showing us where our thoughts might not actually be the truth. They might not be something that God wants us to believe about ourselves. And then once we kind of figure out the right steps to take to get to a goal, the right thoughts to be thinking, the right views to have about ourselves and the results, the outcomes that we can produce. We need some accountability. We need some support in mastering those thoughts in mastering the, the ability to reach the outcome that we want so much. So with coaching, you get one hour sessions, one-on-one -on -one with me for 12 weeks. I'm gonna be starting this in January, 2023. So January, February, and March. You're going to have an hour to just talk through whatever you need focused on. That's why we're calling this Fiat Focus. It's totally dedicated to you and what the Lord is asking of you and wanting to heal in you and help you through. So that when you start in January, whether it's with fitness and nutrition goals or faith goals or something in your marriage or relationship with the Lord, this is something that you can see progress on so that by the end of 12 weeks, 
and you've taken time to reflect on your thoughts in your planner, reflect on prayer and your personal items, you're going to have so much growth that happens throughout those 12 weeks, you know, and I like to see things as you can start a habit. And they say it takes 21 days to form a habit, you know, like making your bed or doing, you know, going out for a run. It might take 21 days in a row of doing that thing to create a habit. It can be so much more sustainable if you do that for 90 days. And so that's where I think this three month, 12 week long program is going to be so much more beneficial than just let's do this hard for 21 days, you know, because when things get to be challenging, you might be able to make it through 21 days without too many bumps in the road, but just looking at the year, there's a, t- as seeing my experience as a health and fitness coach in the past almost seven years, there is a lot of excitement in January. And then there's struggles that come by the end of the month. And then usually with Lent, there's a renewed discipline and Valentine's day comes. And then, you know, different holidays, um, spring breaks comes right around the corner. And I'm just talking like even health and fitness and nutrition right there, but the spiritual aspect waves as well. And we get attacked and we need to be built back up and having that continuity for three months, 12 weeks is going to give you so much more support to be like, this is just what I do. I'm not trying to check the box for making my bed. I am a person. I'm a woman who prays every day. I'm a woman who takes care of her body. I'm a woman who has a strong relationship with the Lord, with my husband, with my children, with my parents, with my coworkers, whatever it is. And really seeing that as truth. So, like I said, I would be so happy to help you with whatever your goals are, whether it's fitness, nutrition, health related, or faith, family, homeschooling, mindset, being able to practice gratitude and having accountability for your goals. So, like I said, for me, having a coach really like shut, like pulled that lens back, sh- shown a light on what I wasn't doing. And that was the thoughts behind the actions in my business. I could go about setting up groups and, you know, reaching out to my clients and seeing how they're doing. But if I was just doing it because I had to check the box, I wasn't actually really growing a business. I wasn't actually pouring into people the way that I could, if my thoughts around it were like, they really need me to support them. They really want me to be their coach. They really want someone to cheer them on. I have the gifts and talents to help them in whatever area of their life. And to see that and to actually shift your thoughts to make it more of like, oh, I want to do this in a different way now. It creates a different action in you that then leads to a different outcome. So um, just figuring out what needs to be done in terms of the thought work is really what's helped me the most with coaching. And um, what you would be able to get from this too is the ability to see your thoughts. Now, this sounds funny, but part of the planner is I have a section that says today's free flow thoughts. And that's where you just get all the thoughts out of your mind. And I just recommend to people to write and write and write until all those thoughts are down on paper because there's something powerful about getting out of your head and onto paper and actually seeing it and be like, wow, I wrote several times, like, I don't have enough time. I'm never going to be able to do this. It's just too busy. Life is too hectic. And these are these huge hyperbole statements, you know, that when we actually narrow it down and think, yeah, I have to change out all my kids' clothes for the season so that my kids aren't still wearing shorts in winter. That's going to take forever. If we can actually see that thought and be like, hmm, is that true? It's like you pop it out of your head and are looking at it and thinking, is that actually true? Do I want to believe, is that serving me? What other thoughts might be believable and true? Because that's where the connection happens with coaching is identifying a thought that's not serving us, finding a thought that is true still, and that we believe because we can't just be like, oh, my house is always a wreck. I'm never going to be able to have it clean. I'm never going to lose this weight. I'm never going to be able to have a strong relationship with the Lord or with my children to shifting to like a thought that's like, things are perfect. It's just wonderful how it is. There has to be that connection. And that's where working through this for 12 weeks, bridging that gap is going to be so beneficial and really identifying a thought that's like, like for the clothes example, I can spend 15 minutes organizing my middle daughter's drawers. I do have that kind of time and it is going to make an impact. And that is good enough. And, and identifying the ways that you can make small changes in your life that do add up to the big changes 
that make you feel the feelings that you want to feel. You get to choose your thoughts to get to the feelings and results that you want. And we do that with the Lord because he wants joy for you. There's going to be times in our life that are challenging and sorrowful, and we need him in that, but we also need him in the joy and he in recognizing that he wants to give us that joy and that he's given us the gifts already. We have an incredible brain. Our brains protect us. They want to shelter us. They want to give us the essentials that we need in life, but that can also limit us sometimes when we think like caveman style, like I can't go outside or else I'm going to get eaten by a saber toothed tiger. It's not actually true anymore, but we might put that kind of fear on trying something new, doing an exercise program that's going to push us. You're not actually going to, you know, fall flat on your face in front of a whole group of people, even if that might be a fear that you have. So I just want you to know that with coaching, you're going to be able to get so much personal attention and you're going to have the tools that are going to help you to change the thoughts that you have to get to the results that you're seeking in your life. Now, Right now, you might be asking, that sounds good. <laughs> I'm very interested in this. And I want you to know that this is something as a new coach is the first time I'm offering this. I have an introductory rate that I'm going to be sharing with you guys. So normally I've heard of coaches that are offering their coaching calls for around $100 a call. So for 12 weeks, that right there would be $1,200. Now the Fiat Fitness membership for the full year is about $240. This planner plus the ebook is valued at around $100. So right there is over $1,500 worth of value. And I'm going to be offering it for $600. So over the course of three months, is one set price of $600 for the coaching. And that is going to carry on for the fitness membership throughout the rest of the year. You don't have to pay more after that. Um, and the planner, obviously, if you wanted another one, that would be an additional cost. But for $600, you get the coaching with me. And you get the, the planner, the workouts, the ebook, so much support from the community of women. And then again, you get those weekly calls with um, me, but also with the community for the 12 weeks. And those will continue on for as long as you want to be a part of them. Right now, I have enough time in my schedule. That I'm trying to be very realistic with my time so that I can best serve you. Because as you know, I'm very busy with homeschooling six kids and doing all the things. Um, so I have time to take on 10 clients as we start the 2023 year. If this speaks to you, if this is something that you feel like would be beneficial for you, please reach out because this is going to be first come first serve. And I want to really get to know how I can best serve you and we can prepare through um, a call or emails, whichever works best for you going into 2023 so that we can get started in that first week, really working on the goals that you have for yourself. So you can email me at meredith.yanashanis at gmail.com or just send me a message on at Fiat Fitness Project on Instagram. You can DM me there too. And please let me know if you would like to get started with me in 2023. All right, have a blessed day. Thank you so much for being here. Again, let me know if you have any questions or if you're ready to get started. God bless you.